you're not going to sit down and learn python or learn you know rust or whatever like you used to 10 20 years ago the way coders are now using these platforms what is your take on it today so first of all we encourage the use of all of these ai tools within our own organization uh, we have certified a whole bunch of i think five or so different tools mm-hmm. vibe coding tools within the company and we encourage developers to use it and say yeah. give us feedback what are you liking what are you not liking what is it good for um what we've seen is that uh it's really good at uh generating automated tests um for qa etc we found tremendous value in um creating user experiences so ui development um sort of back end manipulation of large code bases we haven't seen that much success in but i suspect that these models will get better and vibe coding platforms will get better so i'm a, i'm a believer i think you know when i was in school and i was learning uh, studying to be a, a developer so studying to be an engineer we focused a lot on how to code right yeah. the syntax of coding etc i think the syntax of coding is going to be less relevant going forward because these vibe coding tools understand the syntax they know exactly how to frame things so you're not going to you're not going to sit down and learn python or learn in a rust or whatever like you used to 10 20 years ago however systems thinking is going to be just as important if not even more important and what i mean by systems thinking is how do i take a problem decompose it thoughtfully turn it into modules and have a clear understanding of how these modules interact with each other and then i will use vibe coding tools to go ahead and write the code fragments that i need to assemble this application together but if you don't have that systems level view that systems level thinking you know the vibe coding platform is going to be um a tool in the hands of somebody who has no idea what they're doing and nothing good has ever come out of that right so uh, what we teach our kids in schools and colleges i think will change because of ai uh, but the importance of things like mathematics the importance of systems thinking the importance of you know truly understanding resilience in systems and all of that will be even more magnified 